show you what I picked up when I went to Starbucks what's up y'all so it has been a couple of hours and I figured I would show you what um, I picked up when I went to Target real quick a lot of junk hold on I am super tired but I just want to share with you all the junk raisin bran I was gonna get this uh, lemon cake, pound cake from Starbucks. I was gonna get this lemon pound cake from Starbucks, but I was like, you know what? Uh -uh. I'm gonna get me some archway cookies. So I picked these up and these are really good, especially with milk. And I don't know why, but I keep getting all this junk. This is something new. It's the Hostess, okay. New look, same great taste. I've never tried this, so we're going to see what it do. I was supposed to get my nails done. I ain't feel like it at all. So, I got my feet done, which I'm thankful for. Ooh, they feel so good. But, um, I guess I'll get these soaked off one day soon. Some lactate milk. That's all we drink in this house. Some taco shells. That's what we'll have later on in the week. I want to watch Coming to America, so this is the junk that I'll be watching on. I picked up some shrimp to add. I might make shrimp tacos or either put it in my um, pasta. And some O'Brien's. These are pretty good. Onions and peppers. Yeah, those are good. This is to go with the um, tacos, and this is the taco sauce. This is the mouth. Yeah. Last but not least, from Target, you know, a staple. We don't need to talk about that. And I picked up some creamer because it said uh, classic caramel, natural bliss. And I don't even eat hot dogs, but I've seen these. My coworkers actually had one. They were the, the bigger kind from Jules, but I saw these at Target, so I ended up getting them. And they are the premium cut, 100% kosher beef, beef franks. Yep, so that's what I picked up when I went to Target. On my way out, they have a Starbucks, and I've seen this cup. It's so cute. This was like the last one left, so... yes so i end up getting this and you just screw it on like so and your straw don't come out so i have to wash that and some jelly beans y'all the favorite flavors so my husband cooked, I'm gonna eat what he cooked because I was munching on some fries and some lemonade. I knew not to get a big meal when I went to Chick-fil-A. I had to stop because I was getting really hungry. And um, I got a Cobb salad. This is for tomorrow. 
Okay, so I don't have a, I put that stuff away. I don't have a um, ring light on. I'm super sleepy. I'm sorry that the energy is real low. But I'm just going to share with you all what I picked up. Um, went to MAC. And I back to MAC all of that stuff that I showed you in that video. And I end up getting some free lip glosses. So, I'm going to show you. I end up getting four lip glosses. I'm going to show you. So keep your containers, whether it be your lip liners with the plastic, um, yeah, what else? Um, the containers, your Fix Plus sprays, your compacts, your pressed powder compacts, all of that. Save it and you can back to Mac it. So I have, like I said, four. The first one is Oyster Girl. And I'm going to show y'all how it looks. I don't mind swatching it. But this is Oyster Girl, and it's really pretty. Yeah, so I'm going to swatch it. Because I know y'all might like it. But yeah, that's the Oyster Girl. I hope y'all can see, because... Let's see. Yeah, there it goes. That's Oyster Girl. Then we have See Through. That's like one of my favorites, because it's like a... A nudie, a milky nude, and that's see-through, and it's really pretty with a like a brown lip liner. Yeah, it's a nude, so that's see-through right here. Hopefully, my camera shows these swatches. I'll be wearing it soon, anyway. But yeah, so yeah, Oyster Girl see-through. I can't bring y'all closer. Kind of far. Okay. Then, um, I was kind of on the fence about this. It's called Good Juju. I shouldn't have got it. But it looks like so. Okay. And that's it right there. That'll be cute in the summer months. When you know you just in an area where you don't have to wear um, a mask. Or if you want to take some pictures, make a video. The last one is Love Nectar. This one is also pretty. Love Nectar is it's beautiful. And all these will go good on my skin tone. That's Love Nectar. Yep. So, um, I'm excited about this. All free. Now, that would have been, I know, Mac, tomorrow I think their sale ends with 25% off. So, y'all might want to check them out. And then I went back to um, Sephora. And then I went to Sephora. And I told y'all I like that foundation that I have on right now that I'm wearing. And I went and I purchased it. And it's the Lemur. This is the Soft uh, Fluid Longwear Foundation. And this is in the shade Amber. So that is what I have on. They gave me... Let's see. How much was this? 112. Uh-huh. 112. I waited a whole year to get this. Um, and then I was able to use my 10% off. They gave me a um, Peter Thomas Roth Hyaluronic Cloud Cream Hydrating Moisturizer. And I don't know what this is. Hey, gorgeous, you wanted to just take the time and say thank you. We appreciate your shopping. Let us know in store experience. Okay. I don't know. This is something with fresh. And and she also gave me a Lemur. What is this? A moisturizing soft cream. Yep. That was all that I got from Sephora. One little product, but I do like the foundation a lot. And I stopped at 
Morphe. And the only reason why I stopped at Morphe, I told y'all earlier, is because of this. No, it's not. Because of this here mascara. It is bomb. It was so bomb that I had to get the full size. And it looks like this. And I showed y'all earlier. I'm not going to open it because I don't want no air to hit it. But it is lovely. And she told me I should use the primer that goes with it, which is blue-based. And it makes the, the black pop even more. And this is the big prime. It's called the Big Boost. And I can open this up because I will be using it. And it's the white packaging. And it looks like so. So, I don't know if you have a blue-based mascara. I don't know if this is a different kind of formula other than a mascara. Because it says Lash Primer. You can use that. And then I seen this here lip pencil. And I told y'all that I wanted to find a brown lip pencil. I wasn't going to spend, uh, what is it, $18? I wasn't going to spend $18 in MAC. So I end up getting this pencil. And it's kind of dark. It's kind of dark, though. It's a really, really dark brown. So, I don't know. It's truly dark. It's, it looks like it's darker than um, chestnut. I don't know. Let's see. I don't have no mirror. I'm gonna use my viewfinder. Okay, yeah, that'll work. So, that is all that I picked up from Morphe. I did real good, y'all. And the last thing that I'm going to show y'all uh, Yeah, y'all, so I did really good. And I had like four um, Actually, I had five. I needed one more, which I do have. But I see I have enough to get another lippy or eyeshadow or lipstick. So, yeah, I need one more item to max and max. I'll keep this in this bag. The last product that I'm going to show y'all for the night is this. And it's from, I was going to say Sephora, Sally Beauty. And I don't know, I just went up in there because it's in the mall. And... They have silk elements, the advanced repair, vitamin E moisturizing treatment, and it has turmeric, aloe, and silk. And it says it's for relaxed, natural, and transition transitioning hair. This was the last one left. It has a nice smell. It looks like this. And I can't wait to try it. So I can it says I can deep condition my hair with it. So the silk helps add the shine, the turmeric helps promote healthy looking hair, and the vitamin E provides antioxidant protection while improving hair elasticity. So if you see this and you have it, let me know. And I picked this one up. This is the Clairol Shimmering Lights. This is the Violet Toning Mask. I don't know why I got this, but it looked like it, it'll do something for my blonde. I got another Cricut comb. How much is this? $7.99. Yeah, I got the Cricut comb. Yep. Yes, I got the Cricut comb. And I seen this on the end cap for $3. Somebody told me they used this for heat protectant. It's the B Beyond the Zone Turn Up the Heat. Flat iron protection. I think I used this before, but I wasn't quite sure. And I wasn't going to get the big bottle. So I ended up getting the small little sample size. So that will complete this here 
haul. And guys, I am gonna make me a plate because he cooked. So I'll be back. Okay, before I go, I'm gonna show you my food real quick that my husband made. This is macaroni, sweet potatoes, sweet potatoes, macaroni, cabbage, cornbread, and this right here, it looks burnt, but it is actually a veggie patty with barbecue sauce that he puts in the oven because you know he's a vegetarian, so he don't eat meat and he ain't cooking it either. <laughs> The only time he'll cook some meat is if I'm sick and I need some uh, uh, chicken noodle soup or something. But other than that, yeah, I'm going to get it in, blessing the food that I'm about to receive. In Jesus' name, taking the impurities out that don't belong. May you be fit for this temple in which you reside and all these things we pray in your son. Jesus Christ's name, amen. So I'm going to eat. Girl, I'm so tired. I'm going to try to eat this real quick, take a quick shower on some pajamas and lay it down look at my little cup ain't that cute i ain't want it too tall but that's just right the mac is good Want to see my free stuff I got? Really. Let me show you my empties. I'm back to Mac. We, you um have you have I'm recording. You have you have empty products. Where them pants at? Put them in the pants. I want to see them pants. Bye, y'all.